I'll tell you what, I don't care how cheap a city is, if the weather's too hot or too cold, I'm not going to go there. So I'd like to narrow down our list of cities to just cities that match my ideal temperature and humidity ranges. We'll use the filter function to narrow down our list. Let's do this. I'll create a new constant named filtered cities, which I'll set to the value you get by calling Ramda's filter function. Filter takes a special function called a predicate function as the first parameter. We'll pass in a new function named filter by weather, which we'll create in a moment. Then we'll pass in the scored cities array. The filter by weather function will take a single parameter for the city. As I mentioned a moment ago, this function is called a predicate function, which basically means it's a function that takes some input parameter and returns a Boolean type value. If the return value is true, the city being evaluated is included in the newly created array that's returned by the filter function. If the return value is false, the city is removed. The way I remember how the predicate function works is if it returns false, it's filtered. I'll go ahead and create a couple of constants using destructuring to unpack the temperature and humidity from the provided city, and I'll go ahead and set a default value of zeros for each of these constants in the case that the city doesn't include these properties. Then I'll return a Boolean expression where the temperature is greater than 68 degrees Fahrenheit and the temperature is less than 85 degrees Fahrenheit and the humidity is greater than 30% and less than 70%. If the temperature or humidity fall outside these ranges, then the city will be removed from the list. Let's go ahead and console log the number of elements in the filtered city array, which you can get by calling Ramda's length function and passing in the filtered city array. I'll go ahead and run our code again, and it looks like our list has gone from 100 cities down to 26 cities. Cool. I'd like to sort these 26 cities by the score we've assigned them, and then I'd like to look at the top 10, and that's what we'll work on in the next video. By the way, we're almost at the point where I can show you some of Ramda's killer features, so hang with me, we're almost there.